Hello, Monday. It, uh, Friday was slow because nobody could get logged into the system. It was a problem. Um, so I was expecting today to be a little bit busier. It wasn't. It wasn't that. It was a very slow day. Um, I probably all told did a whole hour's worth of work today. Maybe. Maybe. Um, anyways, it's over and we're out walking. And it's a nice day. It's 70 ish somewhere in there. It was in the 40s this morning. I had to put on a jacket for the first time since I've been here. Um, really, really nice. And the weatherman, apparently he just had an update. He was, must have been on vacation on Friday or yesterday because they updated temperatures for the coming week and they're all in the 80s. So it's going to be in the 80s starting tomorrow. But at least it's not going to be in the 90s. I just, I was so excited to be in the 70s. But I guess I can't have that yet. So anyways, still going to be nice and cool in the morning. Uh, low 50s. I think I saw one day drop down into the, into the 40s this week other than today uh, but anyways that's that's your weather update for for this week and i'm sure it's going to change again tonight because it, it does that um but we are watching some activity in the gulf it's going to get a little breezy down there in florida so i'll we'll be watching out for those folks um but uh, these guys are trying to be sneaky and they're looking for some trail mix so we're gonna keep an eye on them while we're walking ah, but anyways it's monday we're walking it's not a terrible day it's it's a pretty good day it's, I'm, I'm just so tired from doing nothing at work i'm still just kind of just in a brain fog my brain is it's so far from engaged i just don't know what to do with myself so i'm gonna walk these guys i'm gonna see if i can't get the blood going and then i'll be back with you in a bit i'm in the shop holding sandpaper in my hand i forget how old my tools are they've been around for a long time and my poor sander the pad well you see it's got stuff stuck on it the velcro doesn't stick to it anymore these things just fly off so i have to put this down put the sander on it hold real hard and sand as soon as you lift it up that thing will fly all over the place and the sad thing is makita doesn't sell these pads that's all that's wrong with it this thing works tremendously well it just needs that pad but you can't get those pads so you have to buy a new sander fortunately sanders are they're a lot cheaper than they used to be um so i'm just gonna have to do that also this guy he's been around a while too and now the little lock pin you push a little button to hold the chuck in place that, it, that it's been rounded out and it won't hold the chuck in place so fortunately i don't need to use that very often um but it has saved my bacon on this or at least it's given me an opportunity to work on this without buying a 300 dollar oscillating multi-tool and just, the neighbor's dog is barking, so I had to come check on these guys because I'm going to take off. Anyways, that's the tool situation. Um, the dog situation is uh, I was thinking about getting one of those electric fences. I wasn't, one of the invisible ones, I wasn't going to go that way because I don't like shocking these guys for that. And they're very sensitive to any kind of discipline. So, um, They were learning to communicate with each other, and I can tell them very calmly and quietly no, and they will stop doing what they're doing, um, which is nice. Um, but I just don't know if... They, they also don't know how leashes work, and they get tangled. He's wrapped around that mulberry tree right now, which is fine, because I'm going to just remove that thing. Um, but he's stuck. They got him. They, they're, they're stuck now. They're not going anywhere. Um, but anyways, the shot caller. I know that it would work very well here because they would respond to it under most circumstances. 
but in those circumstances where they get locked into something and they they have an obsession when they become when they get to that point of being obsessed will it work that's the question but on the other hand they respond very well to things of that nature I, I dropped something the other day and it wasn't very loud and they both scattered it, I mean that's all it takes it's just a little bit and they go um, but anyways we got the door the door is all everything's cut and ready to go I cut that piece I told you it was sticking out I cut that off poorly so I'm gonna have to get some more of that bondo that wood filler bondo the epoxy kind um, it's a good thing I'm pretty good with that stuff because doing this with the wrong tools is it's a challenge. Also, I just noticed that what the heck is that? What is it for? Accurite. Oh, wait, was that a? That might have been. He might have had a weather station out here and that might be the receiver for it I wonder where that's at or if it's still here oh they got themselves uncovered look at they got they probably solved their problem look at you guys being problem solvers and getting that one from the tree um he's wrapped her all the way around it so he had they would have had to work through that or they pulled the tree up either way it's fine um so anyways we're gonna go i hope you guys are doing well today hope you're feeling healthy hope you're having just a really splendid day the weather is superb right now it is absolutely spot on um such a nice welcome change from what it's been and i wish it would stay this way but it is getting warm again starting tomorrow so anyways i'm gonna go now that i'm thinking about you guys i love you these two knuckleheads are, they're still here. I still have them. So, we'll see. Um, they get better every day. It's like two steps forward and one step back with these guys. But we're figuring it out. They're figuring it out. Also, Goose loves playing with the ball. Maverick. Uh, I'll save that story for another time. I'll tell you a different story about him because we're getting long. So, anyways, more for later. I'll tell you about him. Just know that I love you guys. Thinking about you. Enjoy your cake. I made cake this weekend, so I'm going to enjoy my cake too. So we'll have cake together. Love you.